how to transplant cabbage from a seedbed to a harvesting area. Hello and welcome to Video Jug. We are at Capel Manor College in Greater London. Head of Horticulture and Landscaping, Tom Cole, is going to show us how to transplant young cabbages from the seedbed to the harvesting area. The process applies to numerous members of the Brassica family, such as cauliflower and broccoli. Step 1. You will need a garden fork, a bucket of water, a measuring stick, a trowel, a watering can, some protective netting. Step 2. Digging up. To remove your young veg from its seed bed, carefully push the fork in at the side of the plant, under the roots. Gently pull on the leaves and lift with the fork, being careful not to damage the plants until they are free from the ground. Step 3. Grading. Grading is simply the act of picking the plants you deem most suitable for transplanting. Pick the healthiest looking plants that are at least 15 cm in length with good strong leaves. Once you have graded, keep your chosen plants in a bucket of water and transfer to the harvesting site. Step 4. Transplanting. Measure planting positions at 45 cm intervals. Dig a deep hole at each point and insert a plant. Push in a small amount of soil just to cover the roots so that the plant is held in place. When you are finished, the lower leaves should just rest on the earth's surface. Step 5. Puddling. Before filling the rest of the hole with soil, pour water into the hole with a watering can so that it fills up to surface level. This is important for the delicate plant as it suffers great trauma from loss of water and root damage when transplanted. Push the remaining soil into the hole so that it is filled level with the ground. Check that the plants are deep and firm enough by giving a gentle tug. You should feel a little resistance. Always remember to water in thoroughly. Cover. Finally, after watering the plants in their new patch, cover them with mesh to protect from birds. Lay the mesh over a metal frame and push the edges into the ground with a spade to prevent wind from catching the material. Done. 